Hello friends. Welcome to my new Java programming tutorial. Today I am going to teach you how to declare or make a Java method, class and fields as deprecated. So let's move ahead with Eclipse and see how to declare or make a Java feature as deprecated. Friends, in this tutorial I have created a Java class by name calculator. This Java class has a method by signature public static void main, having string array as a parameter to it. This method is the starting point for the execution of a Java program. This method is called by JVM whenever we run the program. Let's create a method in calculator class by name sum. Public, int, sum, taking in two integer parameters as x and y. This method return a integer value which is sum of x and y. Let's create an instance of calculator class in main method. Calculator, calculator, equal, new, calculator. Using the above calculator instance let's call method sum by passing into it two different integer values as calculator.sum 5, comma, 10. The value returned back is stored into an integer variable say result. Let's print the result on the Java console as system.out.print. The sum is result. Let's run the program. It prints, the sum is 15. Now in future suppose there is a requirement that you want to add 3, 4, 5 or n numbers integer variables together. But as per our current implementation of sum we can add only two integer values. So you now want to replace the old sum method with a new sum method, that can take n number of arguments, and return back some of it. So now solution would be that. You mark sum method in your Java class as deprecated, because a newer version of the method has been created, and the older version will be going away in a future release. In order to make a method deprecated we use at the rate deprecated annotation over the method which we want to make deprecated. Now here our sum method will signify to other applications that, this method will be removed in future releases, with a new sum method. Let's code our new sum method that can take in n number of arguments through var args. Public int sum taking in int dot 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 numbers. Here var args means variable number of arguments. That means to this method we can pass as many int values, and it will return back some of it. Here dot 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 signifies that it's a var arg. Let's code functionality of this method to return back sum of n number of arguments. In this method we are using for each loop, this loop will iterate over each int value in var args and calculate sum of it with previous number. Finally, it will return back us with sum. Let's call sum method now with 2 and 3 int values. Let's run the Java program. It prints, the sum is 15. And, the sum is 35. 
So friends in future release of your class you can easily remove the older version of some method marked as deprecated. This feature can be applied over class. This feature can be applied over fields as well. It indicates to user of the class that, this will be removed in future releases. So friends, hope you like this video. Please give one minute to like, share, comment or subscribe my channel.